Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be showing you guys today my lovely pantry organization video. Now, this is not gonna be your normal organization video. This is gonna be for small pantries. This is gonna be renter friendly. And this is also gonna be great if you are on a budget, so it's totally budget friendly and great for any minimalists as well. So if you have a small pantry or you're renting your house like us and you don't want to invest a whole lot of money, then make sure that you stay watching. Also, make sure that you watch it until the end for the big reveal and how it ended up turning out. I am so happy with it. So without further ado, let's get organizing. So I want to show you guys these food storage containers that I got off of Amazon. I got two packs of them. And when you open up the boxes, these are what they look like. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and get these all washed and dried and ready to go into the pantry. And then I'm going to go ahead and get started with the actual organization. So these boxes, I got the seven piece set and I'm really excited about them. Again, I got two total, so there's actually 14 in here. There's different sizes as you can see. Did you ever stop and think, why spend too much time just getting ready? Let me be honest, I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. When I see you, my heart starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing. Okay, so we have our pantry in this lovely organizer. It's actually a closet organizer. And so when you open it, this is what it looks like. So yeah, it's kind of one of the This is the before. I know it's out of control. So I hope that your pantry isn't quite this bad because it's a little out of control, but we're gonna tackle this and it might take me more than one day. And then step two is to empty the pantry. So we're gonna tackle this. I'm gonna take everything out and I'm going to put it on our table so that I can just start fresh and we'll kind of go from there. And you'll see some of the stuff is already in containers as I like have always had these. And so these are already done, but we're gonna just organize this a little bit better. it to like the cans and stuff I definitely am going to start checking the dates to make sure that everything is good and not expired and so that's kind of the next step here is to check your expiration dates anything that is expired make sure you go ahead and you toss it and then we're gonna keep taking everything out and putting it on my kitchen table so majority of the stuff I did buy during COVID and so that I know that the stuff on the bottom is like fresh and that's why I'm not really checking the expiration dates for those Okay, now that I've got basically everything out of the pantry, minus those few things there, everything is taken out and it is on my kitchen table. I am now going to get the vacuum and go ahead and start vacuuming the shelves really, really quickly. And I'm just gonna quickly clean up the mess that I made as well.
we're gonna do is we are gonna go ahead and get the storage bins out and we're gonna start putting them in the pantry just to kind of see where everything's gonna go. And you can see I got a couple. I got a couple of these ones, just two of them. But I think I might have to go back to the store actually and get more of these. And my favorite thing about this pantry organization is everything is from the Dollar Tree or Amazon. So it's very inexpensive. Again, great for any minimalist, anyone who's not wanting to spend a lot of money, or if you're renting your house and something like that, and you just, again, don't really want to spend a lot of money to organize your pantry, but you're sick and tired of looking at it. And I will link everything that I can below in the description bar. So if there's anything that you're wanting to get, it will be linked there. So moving on, we are just going to go ahead and continue to fill the containers with all of the stuff from bags. And so you'll notice I actually had to switch out my containers a couple times because, you know, I just kind of thought it would fit and then it did not. So I had to switch out a couple, but I am again just going to finish doing that quickly. And then I'm going to go ahead and organize my baskets. And this was filmed over the course of two days, which is why my clothes changed. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure I just found more mouse poop. I like just cleaned mouse poop out of our pantry not long ago. Great. Let me know in the comments. I'm like 90% sure it's mouse poop and that's disgusting. Okay guys, the next step is to put everything back and organize. So this step might take a little bit longer. I organize by shelf and so I start at the top and I kind of go down. And the reason that I could possibly take longer is basically just because you don't necessarily know where everything is going to go and it's all about playing Tetris with everything and seeing where it all fits and moving things as you need. And if you haven't already, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I would love for you to join our growing YouTube family. And again, if you like videos like this, make sure you give it a like so that I know to make more. two more containers for those two as I obviously do not want them in the bag so I'm gonna have to get those and then coming back to the table I'm also gonna need I've been looking for containers for this rice and also this bag of rice for like three weeks now and I haven't found one so I'm gonna look online on Amazon and see if I can get them um, so that I can put those in so for now these are just gonna have to go in like this
Watch me break in your sweat. You're falling into me, touch me. I swear, you would do anything that I want. So keep us awake till the dawn. Ooh, baby, feel free. I wanna make you sweat on me. I wanna make you sweat on me. Watch me break in your sweat. You're falling into me, touch me. I swear, you would do anything that I want. So keep us awake till the dawn. Ooh, baby, feel free. I wanna make you sweat on me. So here is the app. I know it is still not perfect as I am missing a couple of things again I need a basket and I'm going to need a couple more containers so I'm gonna go and get some of those and then you know kind of finish up here but this is the gist of it I hope that this can give you a little bit of motivation to go ahead and organize your pantry especially if you do have a small pantry again mine is in like a closet organizer and you can see again it's very very small and I downsize and throw a ton of stuff so if you like videos like this please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and we'll see you in my next video bye